The Business of Being You Have you ever thought about embellishing your resume? A question that's crossed the minds of many, especially when the job market feels like a battlefield. The temptation to embellish to sweeten the pot a little can be quite alluring. But what does embellishing a resume actually mean? Well, it's when we overstate our abilities, perhaps inflate our job titles just a tad, or maybe even stretch the truth about our employment dates. It's that extra sprinkling of glitter we hope will catch an employer's eye. But here's the thing, while it may seem like a harmless act, it's anything but. It's akin to building a house on sand, and sooner or later, it's bound to crumble. We've all heard the phrase, honesty is the best policy, right? Well, that certainly rings true when it comes to crafting your resume. Now let's delve into some real-life consequences of this seemingly harmless act. Meet John, an ambitious professional who overstated his role at a former company. John had a mid-level role in a marketing firm, but when applying for a new job, he decided to spice things up. He embellished his resume, claiming he was the head of the department managing a team of 20 and responsible for multi-million dollar campaigns. All seemed well until the hiring company decided to conduct a routine background check. They reached out to John's former employer and soon discovered the discrepancy. John's embellishment was laid bare, and the fallout was immediate and severe. The job offer that had been on the table was swiftly withdrawn. Not only that, John's professional reputation took a serious hit. Word spread in his industry about his deception, making it harder for him to find new opportunities. John's story is a stark reminder of the risks involved in exaggerating your role. It's a cautionary tale about the potential pitfalls of not being truthful on your resume. Now, let's talk about Sarah, a hopeful candidate who claimed to have a degree she did not possess. Sarah was a promising professional with an impressive resume, but there was one glaring lie. She had listed a degree from a well-known university that she had never actually earned. This false claim served her well at first, landing her a dream job with a prestigious company. But things took a turn when the company decided to conduct a verification check with the university. The truth surfaced. Sarah did not have the degree she claimed to possess. The fallout was immediate and severe. Sarah was promptly fired, damaging her professional reputation. Legal consequences followed as the company pursued charges for fraud. The aftermath was a daunting struggle for Sarah to find employment again, her name now tarnished in the professional community. Sarah's case is a clear example of the severe consequences of lying about your education. So what are the long-term implications of embellishing your resume? The blow to one's professional reputation can be devastating. Imagine working hard to build a reputation, only to have it crumble because of a lie on your resume. It's a steep price to pay, and the damage can be irreparable. Not just that, there's also the risk of legal action. Some companies take false information on resumes very seriously, and you could find yourself in a legal tangle. Not a pleasant place to be, right? Then there's the difficulty in finding future employment. Once you're found out, word can spread quickly in the professional world. It could close doors that might have otherwise been open to you. So why risk it all? Honesty and integrity are key in building a sustainable career. They're attributes that will carry you far, opening doors and creating opportunities. Remember, the risk of embellishing your resume far outweighs any potential short-term gain. In conclusion, it's clear that honesty really is the best policy when it comes to your resume. We've traversed through the tempting labyrinth of embellishment, unraveling the allure that often leads to overstating roles or even fabricating degrees. We've seen firsthand through real-life case studies the repercussions that follow when the truth inevitably surfaces. These aren't just temporary hiccups, they're long-term implications that can tarnish your professional reputation and trustworthiness. The key takeaway here isn't to shy away from showcasing your skills and experiences. Rather, it's to present them truthfully, confidently, and with integrity. It's about value and authenticity, not just in our resumes, but in ourselves as professionals. It's not just about landing a job, it's about building a sustainable, respected, and fulfilling career. After all, a career built on lies is like a house built on sand, it won't stand the test of time. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and send to a friend. Management for life. The business of being you.